second scrimmage. I remember me earlier, we uh, talked earlier this week, talking about how you want the defensive line and the secondary kind of get a little bit better. You start off with, with the day with two picks. How do you feel like the whole defense did today? Yeah, I think they came out and responded better from last week's scrimmage. They've been, it's been a lot of back and forth on this football team, man. I've, I've been probably the worst referee in the country uh, during the week, just trying to manage this whole deal because we got a lot of talented guys flying around out here trying to do better, and, and uh, they responded all week. I thought offensively we responded as well, so it was just overall a good day for me. And then last thing I want to ask you is, do you feel like this scrimmage is kind of like the final interview for guys to kind of make it on the bus this year? Yeah, so we <laughs> we had a lot of guys, man. We kind of pulled the guys that we know that are in our first group and, and went to guys that were behind them trying to get guys ready to go. The harsh reality is we're only going to dress 75, we're only going to travel 60, so we got to get it down to a point to where uh, we're ready to go. So. I thought that it was a good audition for guys. Uh, we'll get in here and watch the tape, and then tomorrow we'll make those decisions on where guys are going to go. Sounds good. Sounds Western Kentucky. Yes, sir. Hey, man. Every time y'all have a scrimmage, a practice, you the first person to pop up on every screen. Um, you pretty much killed camp. So tell me, was this something you wanted to kind of get established for the season? Uh, yes, sir. You know, I know coming in here, I knew that I wanted to be the go-to, and I worked hard this offseason. I'm just ready to go, honestly. Now, coming to VSU, what was kind of like the biggest transition going from a Division One to Division Two? Uh, just getting acclimated, you know. Uh, there's different resources, you know, but you know, I, I'm just a football player, like so I adapt to, to anything. Now, the last thing I'd ask you is, what it looks like to me is, you're probably gonna be the number one receiver for um, Ivory this year. Um, what are some of the things you kind of want to? get chemistry watch with them before the season starts. You know, just uh, like scramble drill and just knowing what each other, what we want to do on the field, you know, that if, uh, you know, if corners are blitzing, we're going to be on the same page and just knowing where to be and, and just knowing our assignments. We'll be straight. Hey, man. Start the day off great with an interception. And I talked with Tremaine about this earlier this week. He wanted, like, the secondary to kind of sure things up, make sure you guys are all good in the first group. What are some of the expectations you have for the defense this year? Uh, man, well, Every year, Vlad Austin is known to hit you in the mouth every play. So this year, I want us to keep that, that tradition going and just fly around and have fun. If you're not having fun, you're not doing it right. You know, so, and, and football is a serious game, but for a lot of us, it's a place where we express ourselves and we just have fun and get away from the real world. Now, having a guy like Christian going to the next level, playing for the Cardinals now, who is going to be that leader of this secondary this year? Is it yourself? Yes, sir. It'll be me. Yeah, uh, I, I took that role upon, and uh, my, my my guys in the DB group they voted they voted me upon to be the leader, and I just want to keep up the tradition and, and keep it standing up. And I actually got one more thing. I peaked at number six for y'all. Uh, used to play for y'all uh -huh. in 2018, I believe. Yep. Having him back, what's his name by the way? Five okay. uh -huh. Having him back, what are y'all gonna be doing back there at safety? It's gonna be real fun this year. <laughs> it's gonna be a show, man. I mean, hey, I can't, I can't lie to you. If you're not the beige, you're in the wrong place. It's gonna be shows on Saturday night and Thursday night. First game, oh man, it's gonna be amazing. Can't wait to be there. All right, that's all I got. Appreciate.